Hey guys, what's going on? This month we talked a lot about um, the, how versatile spinner baits are and what a great bait they are as far as crossing over from say freshwater to saltwater. Uh, standard safety pin style. This is, man, this is a go-to right here. Just a single Colorado blade, a lot of vibration. You can take this, uh, you can fish it with this skirt or you can take the skirt off and uh, apply your favorite soft plastic, a uh, little bass assassin or something like that, wedge tail minna thing. Uh, give it a little body instead of having the skirt on it or whatever. Redfish, speckled trout, really like it. Uh, this is just a, man, cover a bunch of water and hang on because boy, when they thump it, they thump it. Now, another version would be, it's very similar to like a regular inline spinner bait, but one that's gaining a lot of popularity is like the chatter bait here. You can see this, uh, this blade on the front, it really digs down and gives this bait a whole bunch of wobble. Uh, man, this is a great bait to throw. Man, the redfish climb all over it. Same situation. You can take this, you can fish it with the skirt or you can put your favorite soft plastic on it. Uh, don't overlook these. Great crossover baits. Great uh, for covering a lot of water. Uh, we get those higher tides up around the grass and things like that and those redfish go to digging around on them. Very, very good lures to throw. Uh, something you need to keep in your box. Uh, will certainly improve your arsenal and help you catch more fish. Uh, give them a try. I promise you, you, uh, you won't be disappointed.